Our president of the association, Kofi Siapoku, says members have accepted the president's challenge and have already are uh, working to show up efforts at dealing with the pandemic. I don't know that the COVID-19 is with us. We have no choice. And I said that even big countries like UK and America are all panicking. And therefore, Ghana has to prepare because we don't know what will happen tomorrow. Therefore, we try to find ways where the pharmaceutical manufacturers will make products available for treatment. As of now, there's no cure, and there's only prevention and supportive treatment. With regards to prevention, where we need hand sanitizers and nose masks, etc., etc., we are making sure they are easily available. We know that sanitizers have become scarce. We've developed a basic formula where we are trying to sort out with FDA to make sure that many pharmacies can make it so that it is easily available at the right price. We have seen that sanitizers that are even four CDs are now being sold around 30 to 50 cities. So we want every local to be able to buy. So we have that in place. With regard to the supportive treatment, we are also prepared. We have the machines and the lines to be able to do that. I have asked manufacturers to put aside their normal production schedules and bring up products that will be used to support the COVID-19 so that we make sure that those products are also easily available, which we are doing. Fortunately, the president wants us to even move further to make sure that the pharmaceutical industry is more resource, more companies come up, more factories are also built, so that in future we can be self-sufficient and even export to the neighboring countries who are not really strong as we are. And a small group has now been formed for us to meet and deliberate and go into details as to the modalities for the implementation of this discussion.